currently we're getting heavy rain and thunderstorms. Um, there was a rumble of thunder about two minutes ago. And there's actually an even heavier band of rain with thunder and lightning coming in off of the ocean right now. This is not that band yet. That band is still about 10 miles away. This is a slightly lighter band, but there is still some lightning with it. Um, I actually did not see the lightning, but I heard some thunder. That's why I came outside to film. It hasn't changed over to sleet yet, but we're going to get some more snow tonight. This morning we actually had about close to 10 inches of snow. Now it's changed over. It's about 34 degrees. Now we're getting strong winds coming from this band of heavy rain. It's not that windy, but... Just watch and enjoy. The rain's letting up a little bit. As these are kind of like individual bands coming in. Um, convective bands. Um, currently in a little bit of a lull right now. Um, but there is still lightning. Occasional flashes and rumbles of thunder. I'm going to wait for the rain to completely stop before I go outside. You know, so I don't get my iPad all soaked up. Let's see. Still coming down at a pretty good clip. Wait another couple minutes. Um, the heaviest of this band is actually over Coney Island right now and over Brooklyn. That's where the heaviest of the storm is right now. Current temperature is around 34 degrees. Um, we're not getting any sleet at the moment, but I wouldn't be surprised if we get some sleet or even hail because they're kind of cold aloft and this is caused by the cold air. This thunderstorm is caused by the cold air aloft. And with the warmest it's being at, is at 40 degrees, we might get some sleet or even hail possible. I think there might be some hail. I mean, the radar is detecting small hail about a quarter of an inch di in diameter, about half an inch in diameter. But I don't know if it's actually going to hail, but we might get some small pieces of hail as the heaviest of the storms pass over in about 40 minutes. Uh, most of the lightning so far has been intracloud as I have not seen any cloud to ground strikes on the tracker in the New York City area. But I spoke to a person who said he did see some lightning and hear some thunder as he was walking outside. Same rumble that I heard. So yes, this is in fact a um, thunderstorm right now. But I haven't, you know, videotaped any thunder yet. He, t uh, he told me that's about one or two rumbles every ten minutes. Maybe if I continue filming, I might be lucky enough to catch a sh flash or a rumble. The thing is, I can't keep filming because my iPad is about to run out of memory. So, this video might be in two parts. I just saw a flash of lightning. I just saw a flash of lightning. I don't know if you saw it, but I did just see a flash of lightning. I heard a small rumble, but it looks like it was too high up in the clouds to produce any significant thunder. Um, looks like the lightning flash was about three to four miles away, and it took almost about 20 seconds to reach here. It was almost 20 seconds, about three to four miles away. But I'll make another part of this video. This will be winter storm uh, um, packs part four. Thunderstorm Part 1 and Thunderstorm Part 2. There will be two parts to the Part 4 video. The Thunderstorm Part 1 and Thunderstorm Part 2. 
Um, thank you for watching and uh, please leave a comment. Oh, you just saw another flash. Actually, so I'm going to extend the video a little bit. So you're going to see any, uh, th hear any thunder. This one seemed pretty close. No, uh, this has been a pretty small uh, rumble again. Barely audible. Well, thanks for watching, and please leave a comment, and I'll make another video as the main band approaches in about 30 minutes.